Clifford, no doubt, is a visionary. Uh, I've seen him firsthand in his building on, on Broadway, the Promise Center, and a lot of other activities where Clifford saw something that nobody else saw, and he believed in it. And some of you talked about uh, passion or commitment. He certainly has that. And one of the reasons I'm backing Clifford, not only because he's the best man, I think he's the only man for us at this time. Uh, Clifford has talked about two things I think is important. Our educational system and how we need help. And we need help in the way that we need to have this community to, to recognize that we can build a world-class public school system and not have to have an alternative school system. If we want to have a supplemental school system in addition to a good public school system, that's fine. Clifford and I and Sam, we served on industrial authority together. I served at the chairman of the chamber. So when Clifford talks about economic development, I've been at the table too as well. And I know how important that is. In two areas that Clifford's got a lot of strength in is economic development. We've got to be able to give our young people a reason to stay in Macon and build and rather than losing our best and our brightest. So that means good jobs, well-paying jobs. So we got to do that. Clifford has tremendous experience in being able to do that. And the other thing is our educational system, as I mentioned, we've got to make it a system where everybody, and I mean everybody, can feel comfortable being in that system rather than having going to an alternative system. So I think it's important. So with that being said, I think with Clifford's vision and his commitment, his passion, and you put that all together, I think he certainly is the man to lead us uh, in the future. And so he has my 100% uh, support.